So I was once asked, is it possible that individuals with ADD, ADHD are actually gifted? Are we missing a lot of those kids? And we, we definitely are. If you think back to, again, the root cause that develops the learning disability, that visual spatial style of thinking that is allowing for misperceptions, what it does on a daily basis is works wonderful in the three-dimensional world. If you think three-dimensional and you think visually, you are an expert at solving problems and creating and using that imagination in the real world. It's a whole different way of measuring intelligence. These individuals, because they think visual spatially, not verbally, again, it's very common, common knowledge that there's two forms of thought, verbal thinkers and visual thinkers. Verbal thinkers think as fast as they can talk. So they think in sentences or in words. Visual thinkers think in pictures. And just like the old adage, a picture is worth a thousand words, it's true when you're thinking as well. It's shown that visual thinkers think probably 40 to 200 times faster than a verbal thinker. So we really need to stop thinking of these, this style of thinking as a deficit and just give the individuals a way to turn off the obstacles that are caused by this form of thinking. And quite honestly, it's our educational system that puts many of those obstacles in the way. Some of these individuals, we would just leave them alone, would be very, very successful in life. But we try to push these little square pegs into round holes.